I am really excited to look through this one. It is Bake Anime by Emily J. Bushman. There are 75 recipes in here, and I'm, I'm really pumped. I love this stuff. So we have our table of contents, pretty bold. Japanese desserts, non-Japanese desserts, and anime-inspired desserts. So not everything, I guess, is from anime, but she definitely did her best. So we have tools of the trade, very handy. Um, so let's get into this. We have Mitarashi Dango. Here it, on the top, it says, oh, this is my favorite anime. One of my favorite animes. This is from Samurai Champloo. Uh, here we have how long it takes to cook, what you actually need, and what it, it is. So it's dairy-free, gluten-free, nut-free. It's vegan. This is amazing and so handy, and I'm glad that they're starting to do this in a lot of pop, pop culture books. That doesn't happen. There's usually a photo on the side for almost every recipe. Here we have where it's actually featured. So like Fu, Mugen, and Jean brushed up with soy sauce syrup. Oh, God. Okay. I'm so excited. We have Sakura Daikon. This is from Dagashi Kashni. And Kashi, and I have not seen that yet. I apologize. Very vibrant drink. It looks like radishes. Here's a... Uh, Narakiri, this is from Ca Card Captor Sakura. So there's so many different recipes in here. Uh, this is from My Hero. This is Custard Taiyaki. I really want to be able to have this. It's not gluten free. I love that we have so many photos here. Uh, we have this is, oh, that, this one is a Siberia cake. This is from The Wind Rises. Wow. Here's a photo of that. So we have recipes that are kind of, they can be a little tough, but they're pretty, I mean, there's some that are really easy. So this is the lemon almond chiffon cake from Spirited Away. I love this. Um, This is from Food Wars chocolate checkerboard cake. Look at that. That's so cute. Some of these, and like I said, some of these recipes like this one, very elaborate. Lots of instructions because it's a checkerboard shape, so it's probably crazy difficult. Here we have, this one is Mont Blanc. I've never, I don't have my glasses on, so I apologize. Here's a small picture of that one. This one is from Food Wars as well. So there are some recipes that have, that are featured in multiple series or there's multiple series featured in here. Uh, again, that one's Food Wars too. Lots of Food Wars. Okay. This one is from Yumiro Patisserie, which I've not seen as well. So I like that we don't have just some mainstream anime in here. Uh, lots of it, ha I mean, there's different kinds of anime all throughout. And I love that they featured Samurai Champloo. That's, I mean, that's a classic. This one's from Tanaka-kun is always listless. <laughs> uh, strawberry Melon Pan, uh, Lucky Stars, Chocolate Cornet. So lots of fun recipes for real. I hope you guys have been able to see most of these. And we do have Sword Art Online, Secret World of Arietti. Wow, this is awesome. So if you are looking, for, if you are an anime fan, I do recommend this fun little cookbook. Plus, it gives you just like things that you can do if you want to or things that look very anime or something that might have been featured in an anime, maybe. But it's, these are really fun. So check this out. This is, I can, I could probably show you this entire book because I love this. It is Bake Anime by Emily J. Bushman. There's 75 sweet recipes in here. All bakes, all fun with the anime reference in here. Perfect. Uh, if you are looking for more cookbooks, make sure to join us on Instagram, Facebook, and Pinterest. And make sure to comment down below on any cookbooks you guys want to check out or see. Uh, we're more than happy to do that for you. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time.